everybody. Scott, back here with another video, a little update on the uh, 65 Cutlass F85. Since the last time I made a video, I've gotten a uh, new uh, Krager uh, Street Pros. They're 15 by 8. Uh, with the Goodyear Eagle number ones on there. They're a nice riding wheel. Gets it up a little bit from the 14s I had on there. Vinyl top still holding up really nice. You can see the solidness of the car. The original 330 Oldsmobile Rocket. It's got like 315 or 325 horsepower. You can see it's nice and clean, runs super smooth. Original radiator, manual brakes, power steering. I just put a new oil filter on it. The one that was on it was kind of a cheapie, so I got a, a Napa Gold. So uh, it's on there and I replaced uh, the transmission uh, cooling lines the other day and uh, they turned out really nice. See it runs pretty nice and smooth. It's a 65. It's cold out here today, so it's uh I just started it. See how nice the door panels are. All original, still in really good shape. I believe the seats have been redone at one time. They got new covers on them, but they are definitely uh, in really nice shape. Six by nine speakers in the back. I'm guessing them to be fairly original or pretty close, but I don't, I'm not for sure. Got the roll down windows in the back. All the lights work. Uh, original steering wheel dash, it's got 98,000 miles on it. It's the F85, as you can see. It's got an aftermarket radio probably put in in the 80s, I'm guessing. Maybe sometime in there. Got the ashtray, got some extra gauges. Uh, like I said, everything works in here. Carpet, I think is original. It's got some faded marks in it and you can tell it's seen some better days but it could be from a later restoration but everything looks really good in here got the uh, yellow headlights I just always like those the nostalgic plates it's just a fun driver. Well, I hope you guys like it. Thank you.